showrunners of the main Game of Thrones series, David Benioff and D.B. Weiss, shared how shocked they were that so many people hated the finale, which is so crazy to me. Their answer is just so egotistical about this, I'm warning you now. So starting with David Benioff, he actually thought that it would be an even split of people both loving and hating the finale in the final seasons. Here's what he said. I think we knew it would be controversial. We hoped that it would be a little more 50-50 even. You hope for a better proportion of, we definitely didn't want it to be quite so much hate. We were prepared for some of it, but... So yeah, besides him being a bit delusional, David thinking it was even going to be 50-50 is a bit odd. Do all showrunners think that 50% of their viewers will hate their ending? Is their goal just to make 50% of their viewers happy? Because there's a lot of shows that have actually stuck the landing with their finale and final season, and I feel like maybe you want to aim for a majority liking your ending, and that doesn't mean appeasing your viewers by doing exactly what they want, but by actually having a really good, well-thought-out ending. There have been plenty of shows where I hate how the character ended, but I understand based on the story and the development why it happened, and I've still enjoyed the finale. Weiss also chimed in about the surprisingness of the backlash, sharing, I guess I hadn't taken into account the net worth effects that can help the show when they're working in your favor as a positive feedback loop. It's hypocritical to love it when it's blowing in your direction, and to decide it's the end of the world when it's going the other way. But I think that, yeah, that was the part of it that we hadn't really accounted for knowing that some people were going to like it, and some people weren't. Can you imagine being so high on your own supply that you didn't even think that maybe people wouldn't like how you did the finale and how you wrapped up one of the biggest shows on the planet? But DB also said something that I feel like a lot of us have known, that D&D basically became super into themselves. They were super egotistical. They had done so well for so long. They began to think, okay, we're untouchable. Everything we do, it turns to gold. They really couldn't see from the outside that more that they didn't have the source material anymore for George, that the more downhill the show went and the characters just started having horrible dialogue and their plot lines got very weird and cliche. So I do think this is a case of you get so much applause and love for so many years that you think, oh, everything I do is fantastic. And that's partly what doomed them in the end. 